I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. And you two got along swimmingly, didn't you? Exchange numbers, too. Two birds of a fucking feather. Losing our cool won't do us any favors. It's a waste of time. Oh, I'm cool. Real fucking cool with the fact that Ev's probably already dead. You don't know that. And I'm sure as hell not gonna squander precious minutes we could spend looking. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. Better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. Could be we'll see something to point us in their direction in one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. That's an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. Think I've got a better idea. Know where we can get our hands on an XBD. Might not be a death's head, but it'll be a start. Was on a contract, taken out on a guy named Jotaro Shobo. Mm-hmm. The mocks put a bounty on his head. So you were the one to cut him down. Found out he was dealing in XBDs. Sourced from someone on Jig Jig Street. Got the coordinates. Meantime, see if I can't find something on the NCP domain. I'll wait in the van. get with me. What's your edge? Want something that'll floor me. Really scramble the neurons. I'll come back some other time. Betting on it. How about you? You buying or just gonna stand there like a pig undercover? Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? You a badge? If I was a badge, you'd already be in cuffs for what you sold the customer before me. All right, all right. Can't be too careful. What do you want? Give me the best of the best. Ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. How about a discount for your newest customer? Only give regulars discounts. If you're short, then fuck off. Where do you get these scrolls? 
said you weren't a pig. Just curious, that's all. Once you booted up your virtue, dare say your curiosity will be satisfied. People that make these, <laughs> obsessed with privacy. Never even occurred to me to ask where they're from. To which caution I probably owe the fact that I'm still alive, talking to you. Got anything that might interest me? Pleasure doing biz with you. Hop in. Let me get everything prepped. You make sure the wreath's snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. The old one, too. Ready when you are. I want you to describe what you see. My catch from the Editing mode's good to go. Dig around all you want. Ordered recently. Scab woman. <laughs> Who knew that sides chopping people up they were scrolling XBDs? Electric cork patch on the coveralls. Ordinary box. Decker, Tanaka, and Rogers logo. Standard for a trash heap. Can't beat that rich synth cough aroma. Cheap shit. Cold too. Mm-hmm. Buck a slice. Coffee was cold. Like, from the day before. Pizza looked fresh, though. So? Means someone's grabbing buck a slice regularly. Which is not something one does for the flavor and fresh ingredients. Pizza shares its DNA with styrofoam. Nobody's gonna schlep across town for it. Okay. We're looking for an electric core power plant located near a buck a slice. EC used to have a big old complex in Charter Hill. Buck a slice chicks out too. How can you be sure though? Thermal readings are off the charts. Keep looking.
Here we go. Old Electric Corp power plant in Charter Hill. Gotta make do with that for now. Nothing else to garner from this spoil. No time to lose. We gotta go there. Definitely. Ride with me? Let's get going. On our way. Still can't shake it. That virtue sample we saw with the death said moth. If all they scroll is snuff, then... Stop it. They'd have to be utter gongs to waste her on something like that. What do you mean? We're talking about a girl who's not only a natural at what she does, but also has got a doll's implant. I mean, that's not a package you find lying out in the street. And here we are. We going in? Find us a way inside. I'll hang back, scan the subnet, see if there's any blueprints of the complex lying around. Join you as soon as I find something. Let's link on Hollow till then. All right, going in. has not exceeded the average. However, in an abundance of caution, the NCPD has raised the threat level to two, advising travelers to avoid side roads. continue to keep you informed as the situation develops. Feeling tired? Bored? Powerless? Not anymore. Experience all the Crow Manticore's 16 new flavors and mix it.
Welcome to N54. It's time for your local news. Violence continues to plague the Badlands. Shootings have been reported along the 1, 166, and 101. Eyewitness accounts point to inter-clan disputes. Attacks on unaffiliated persons has not exceeded the average. However, in an abundance of caution, the NCPD has raised the threat level to two, advising travelers to avoid side roads. We'll continue to keep you informed as the situation develops. Don't make trouble. Be trouble. But there's smoke. Got the blueprint. Be there in a sec. Try to find a way to the lower levels. interesting once in a while. A joke! Whatever, I don't care. We have nothing but time to kill in this town. What did you last see on TV? Or did you pick up any woman? Made. Let's try food. Did you eat anything good lately? Will you say anything?
Found a way down. You see my position? Yep, be there in a sec. Wait for me. with it. Hear that? We don't have enough methionine for today's batch. Relax. We'll add RTL and the weight will be right. RTL? Erythritol. It's like candy. <laughs> are only the tip of the iceberg. <sighs> Smells like propylmethionine. Must be cooking RPM here. RPM. Used to sprinkle it on my breakfast. That shirt. I know it. Just get rid of them my way. Your call, but you've got to make it now. How do you 
No. I've seen his body. I know. He's the boss, isn't he? So he should live like one. He's the boss because he can get any pussy to work for dirt. Pussies like you. It used to be that pussies were just pussies. Now we're the ones with our dicks in our hands. Hey, what the fuck? Ну что опять? to the hallway. of its surroundings on the inside thanks to crystal dome tech behind the wheel you can see everything as clear as day but nobody can catch even a glimpse of you <laughs> that means if you purchase it with standard armor plating this british sports limo is safer than a tank and as i'm sure you know it offers special connection the erudite's interior is one of the most expensive tastes imaginable Back in the samurai days, we'd place ads in this thing looking for background dancers. Looks like you weren't the only ones with bright ideas. It was a veritable gold mine of women. But if you are watching, imagine you're sitting on a pile of eddies. No, wait, a room full of eddies. A swimming pool. A football stadium. <laughs> Now take that and multiply it by a hundred. Congratulations! Now you can... A Rayfield Arendite, the perfect blend of style and substance. Arguably the peak of automotive luxury. resources hidden under the ice has spurred on the continent's rapid economic development. Though some environmental degradation has occurred as a result, inhabitants of the South Pole are still enjoying life as Antarctica's first dollhouse was recently opened. But perhaps most appealing to locals and newcomers alike is the astonishingly low crime level. Antarcticans enjoy a murder rate of only 70 per 100,000 residents. Thank you for watching N54 News. We'll see you next time. Oh, my God. 
I see a way down. Careful. Two live ones there. I'll distract them. You take them down. What are you thinking? Show's about... Screw with those pipes. Get some smoke going. The hell? Now! Take them out! These are solid steel, not the softcore plastic kind. Even if you come here on your own gunning to become a star, there's no guarantee you're ever getting out. maintenance room. See what I can stir up. Gutted out all her implants. And why stop there? Took a few internal organs while they were at it. How so very resourceful. Scabs. No matter how many you stamp out, there'll always be more crawling around somewhere. Figure you've made their acquaintance. Afraid so.
What's there to hate? That nobody checks on us and every day is chill. That we don't have to stand outside all day in the rain? That sucks so much. <laughs> Smells like piss on a rotting corpse. Always something. Не нравится мне это. А? Good one, Mr. Q. I actually work in the Oak Ridge Hospital. 
Well, you sure are a funny guy, Ivan. Let's go back to basics, shall we? Just what is... Used him as a puppet and a virtue that killed him. Then tore out his implants. Psychological health, even after what we call a full body condition. So tell us, what? Well, it depends on what, but the most vulnerable are undoubtedly those who display antisocial tendencies. What if implants aren't the real problem? I mean, sooner or later, wouldn't those kinds of people snap by themselves? In all fairness, there are prominent voices in the scientific community who claim we're confusing correlation with cause and effect. And say that cyber psychotic attacks are a manifestation of societal degradation, like mass shooting. The only difference now is that people don't just have enough. I'd start by saying that there is an indisputable connection and psychological disorders. We've seen this with rats. When we replace one-third of their body with cybernetic equivalents, they become five times more likely to display psychotic... Sheesh! Well, I just hope I don't meet any of those cyber rats on the subway. <laughs> Where are you? Close to the studio, I think. You find anything useful? Read up the elevator. It should be easier to get out of here. All right, I'm here. Let's find her. Hang in there, Ev. Evelyn, just don't touch her. 
If she's recording, you'll scramble her brain. Wait until I cut her link. I see her. Cable two. Grab it and tell me when you're gonna yank it. I'll break the link at my end at the same time. What do you think? What do I do now? What we came here to do. Find the truth. Ask her. Johnny, she's unconscious. Or she's a better actor than we thought. All right, let's do this. Wait for my signal. Here goes. Ready? And... Thank God. Ev? Evelyn, you hear me? What's wrong with her? Honestly, I don't know. Jerking around the cable probably didn't help. Um... Hey, Evelyn. I need you to tell me who hired you. Seriously, V! You gotta do this now?! She okay to be moved? No brain hemorrhages, damage to the spine? Doesn't seem to have any wounds. Guess we got no choice. Let's get her somewhere safe. Fast, too. Which way? I sealed the doors and managed to power the elevators. Elevators it is, then. Come on, is it really that hard? Please, just one. For me? Won't hurt those rosy lungs of yours any more than that fresh night city air. Smoking's for posers, and it stinks too. Say whatever the fuck you want, but just light up. No. Non-smokers are the fucking worst. Just my luck. We going in? What's there to wait for? Didn't go through hell and back just to stand in front of a door. Mm -hmm. 